Hey everyone, Tiger Tanaka here, and welcome back to more DBZ BT3. In the last part, we beat up Frieza's big brother, Cooler, and in this part, we're gonna be starting the Android Saga. Great translation there, guys. But yeah, that little cutscene basically summed up what happens right before Cooler. So yeah, let's do this. Yeah, Trunks gives Goku the antidote for that, but it takes a while to actually take effect. So, yeah. They kind of forget to mention that. Just like a lot of other things. Oh my god, his voice. Yeah, geez, look at Goku's health right now. Yeah, the thing about these androids is that they can absorb energy. So if they... Yeah, they heal. And drain energy. Yeah. Oh my god, you're so annoying! Oh, hey, I got a Dragon Ball from that. Yeah, in these story mode saga fights, you can find Dragon Balls if you destroy some terrain. It's randomly hidden in one terrain. Shit. Get me out of here. Thank you. Not quite. Oh, come on! Yeah, you can see that did literally nothing to him because he absorbed all of it. Sure about that? I don't know if I'm supposed to lose here, or if I just wait for the timer. I guess I'll find out here. See if he absorbs this. Nope, he got left open for that. But yeah, I can only find one Dragon Ball per fight. Like, per Saga thing. As long as that Dragon Ball thing is up there, you can't get another one. Wait, he's... he can't see me. Ah. I don't know if I was supposed to lose that or what. Shut up, your voice is so annoying. And yeah, I was supposed to lose there, good. Oh, hi Vegeta. Maybe your data is insufficient. Ever think of that? No, oh, I wish they would have done it word for word. That made it so much more epic. But yeah, Vegeta has trained himself to become a Super Saiyan. Uh, who the fuck said that? 
Seriously, I don't even remember them saying that in the anime. I don't know about the manga, because I haven't read it, but still. Who made up the rule that you had to have a pure heart to become a Super Saiyan? Ah, oh, he dodged it. I want to see if I can finish it with Big Bang Attack, though. Okay. Yeah, that's the thing about Super Sans. If you haven't learned how to control it yet, they become even more fierce in nature. They're not exactly as... Well, Vegeta pretty much explained it perfectly there. He's not as forgiving. Nice! Yep. Bye, Android 19. Nice knowing you, except it really wasn't. Yeah. In the anime, Vegeta just completely wrecks Android 19 after 19 basically wrecks everyone else. Also, Yamcha gets killed. Well, he doesn't get killed, but he comes really fucking close to dying. And we got a special saga, and the one-star Dragon Ball. I don't remember what special saga that is, actually. So let's see here. I unlocked a new battle. Androids 19 and 20. This is very different from the future I'm from. I'm gonna go see what that special saga was real quick, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I found out what the new saga was. And I think we're gonna do this now. Because if I remember correctly, this happens before 17 and 18 come up. Or at the very least, before Cell comes up. So, yeah. Like I said, I'm trying to go about this in the most canon order I possibly can. I may do a couple of things out of order, but that's just because my memory is bad. But yeah, Cooler's back. Because this new star by the new planet Namek is powering him up. He fused with the star and it gave him a metallic body. And he's pretty damn strong. <laughs> oh, just wait. Just wait. It's not so much his power that's frightening, it's what the star does for him that's frightening. You'll see what I mean here once we beat up Cooler here. There we go. Oh crap, I didn't expect him to... Well, for a second there, I thought the emulator was about to crash again. That would have sucked. Yeah. Take this. Says the one who's getting his ass kicked at the moment. Let's rush him. Or not. And yes, I finally learned how to deflect throws. It's basically the same as key attacks, only I gotta time it better. Okay, next uh, advancement. Super Saiyan! Good. 
board, you were getting your ass kicked. Also, by the way, a cooler is regenerating health. Very slowly. Yeah, that's kind of important stuff there. Metal cooler regenerates and regenerates and regenerates. Meanwhile, you get weaker and weaker. Damn it. Oh crap, lock on, Buster. That's a really good move. Meteor smash. I'm gonna smash you into tiny pieces like Goku was talking about just a minute ago. But yeah, I guess they don't really go into it in this game, but... The, the big Getty star makes several copies of Cooler. So you literally have an entire army of metal coolers to deal with. They represented this better in Tenkaichi 2, where he had an entire team of five meta coolers to fight. Ow, ow, ow! Okay, come on. There's Vegeta. I was wondering when this would pop up. Why are you apologizing? Didn't expect that, did you? <laughs> I didn't come to save you. I just didn't want him to kill you. Take that. Yeah, this is supposed to be after an... Oh, here we go. Yep. What? What's going on? Oh, come on, Vegeta. You were barely injured. Yep. My Kamehameha really beats your finger blitz barrage by far. Yeah, I did it too late. Damn it! Crap! There we go. Damn it. I keep falling for that. Not anymore, though. Yeah, I screwed up. Take that. Wait, that's it? Okay. I haven't. That was easy. Well, don't worry. It's the last time you ever have to fight him. Yeah, I didn't think that ended so quickly. I guess I should explain how there is another Namek, though. The, they use the Dragon Balls to wish the Namekians another planet Namek. So, yeah, there's that. And we didn't unlock a new special saga, so that means we gotta continue with the Android Saga to do anything. And we're 31% done with the story mode, so we're almost a third of the way done with this Let's Play, if memory serves. So next time on DBZBT3, we will be continuing the Android Saga. See you guys then!